My name is Dr Gemma Actrell um, and I work as the lead scientist for our Space Systems Programme and I'm also Chief Scientist Space Weather. I joined DSCL in 2010, so I've been working here for about sort of 12, 13 years now. I work really closely with our frontline command partners, our international partners, um, across UK academia, UK industry, in order to help understand the impacts of space weather on different types of system. So extreme space weather is one of the risks on the National Risk Register. It really requires um, a collaborative team effort from lots of different government agencies to make sure that the nation is advancing its preparedness against the severe space weather strategy. That feels like a huge responsibility, um, but also it's a huge privilege as well. The most exciting thing about my role is probably the sheer breadth of different people I get to interact with, the different topic areas, the different systems. Um, there's always something challenging that needs doing. I think it's probably the variety um, I find is the most exciting part of the role. Always something new to learn. I did actually want to be a fast jet pilot at one point, but I found out I had to have glasses, so I wasn't able to pursue that career. But I'm actually really grateful for that now because it made me go to university and study physics. So <laughs> it's ended up in a really interesting loop in that I now work very closely with our avionics colleagues. Sort of a tagline phrase that's used in the space industry, which is that space is hard. <laughs> it's also what makes working in space really interesting and in order to achieve success in space, every part of the puzzle, every part of the chain has to be perfect. You don't get a second chance to just nip up and tweak something slightly, you know, once it's, it's there, it's there. It feels a real privilege to be working on something that impacts not just what we do here within defence, also impacts, you know, society, humanity as a whole. I think there are certain points in your career where you get to step back and just kind of understand what you're doing and what you've achieved and just take a second to be really proud of that.